welcome back to a new vlog i don't know what's going on but i've been slipping okay no honestly i took a break last week from vlogging first of all like i'm two weeks behind on my vlogs and i said that i did not want to get behind on my vlogs i want them to still be current the vlog that's going up tomorrow is two weeks behind so the next vlog i'm going to be editing is going to be two weeks behind but first of all let's get to the date today is thursday december 28th um i think i stopped vlogging a week ago and i stopped because i'm like there's really no point of me vlogging right now because i'm already behind already as it is um i kind of just wanted to take a break and just be so i did that um but yeah so i wanted to like talk to you guys see check in with you guys see how was your christmas um i had a great christmas um um, what did I do last week? I really didn't do much of anything to be quite honest. So for Christmas, I went to see my mother and then I went to, I had a great Christmas though. I look really pretty. I look real cute. I look real together. I went to the thrift store on Christmas Eve. What a hit. I have all the items that I, not all of them, most of them hanging because I washed them. I found so many cute things. Like usually when I go to the thrift store, I either come out with nothing or I come out with a lot. And I came out with a lot. So I wore, I already wore it, but on uh, Christmas I wore a one sleeve like sweater shirt. That was from Lulu's like Lulu's and it was like seven dollars and then I found this I haven't ironed it but it's like a sweater I plan to wear this for work it's like a sweater but the back is like you know like a little white number and then this it's kind of funky but it's like one of those shirts where it like this and then goes over here so cute the fabric is so nice the color is like cognac it's so nice it's from philanthropy I don't know but this is such a cute top and then I found this you can never go wrong with the classic black sweater um looks really nice and then i found this little blouse here like a square neck it's black and white polka dot from shein and then i found this i'm kind of sad that it went into the dryer and it shrunk it was like it was like down here <laughs> and now it's all the way up here so it fit me really nice i can wear this without anything under but i intended to wear this like with a long sleeve shirt under and a turtleneck it is so cute so i found those things and then i also found a couple of belts because i wanted to get some new belts um so i found like an all brown belt this one was five dollars it's just like an all brown regular leather belt and then this one is the thinner belt, but it's with a gold buckle, which is what I love to wear. And then I found this cute little purse. It's from The Gap. This is so cute. So it's like this, but it comes with the strap to wear as a, what is that called? Crossbody, a crossbody. So it also has this strap. And I was all nosy. I'm like, where did this purse from? It's that gap. I'm like, okay, period. I see you. I mean, this goes perfectly with this belt here too. So it was a nice little come up. A nice little come up. I went to Savers in case anyone's wondering what thrift store I went to. They have a couple of locations out here in Arizona. I went to Value Village because I was already on the west side. I went to um, Living Spaces to look for a couch. And I let me go to the Value Village because that's the only time I ever go there because it's all the way out on the west side. Um, so I went out there and it said temporarily closed. So I'm so sad because we only have two value villages out here. So I don't even, I didn't even bother going to the other location. I want to do a try on haul. So that's that. Um, but yeah, right now I'm about to pack my things. My vlog is going up. It's uploading into my channel. So by tomorrow, the 1080 HD version should be available. Cause usually if I upload and then like the second it's done finalizing, if I was to publish it, you guys are going to be watching it like at 360 quality. So like the low, low quality. So it's always best to get up at least 24 hours in advance prior to you publishing. So that way when you guys do watch it, it is at a high quality or you guys can choose to watch it in a high quality. So anyways that's neither here nor there so i'm gonna pack my things and i'm about to go stay at my friend's house i am going to the gym in the morning um and then tomorrow i'm gonna go pick up my mother i asked her if she wants to go with me to american furniture warehouse i'm gonna look online to see like what other items they have because i was online at work today and i seen they had a few things that were in my price range um they had a sofa and a love seat um deal and the couch the fabric is really really cute and like warm and fuzzy but yeah this is one of the gifts i got for christmas i didn't get a lot of christmas gifts which i really don't care i know i'm not used to getting christmas gifts anyway so i only got two gifts this year right 
three gifts. My grandma gave me money and then he um, got me this, which is my favorite of all time perfume. It's the Chanel Chance. I'm like, oh, he got me the big bottle. Cause I always got the small, I always get the one fluid ounces. He got me the three fluid, right? And he got me a, a necklace from Gorgiana. So those are the things I got for Christmas. In, in case anyone's wondering what I got for Christmas, I got a perfume and a necklace. I'll show you the necklace, I might as well. I think I'm gonna wear this tomorrow. I've been really loving it. Cause my friend, she has um, a necklace from Gorgiana, but hers is just the, the hoop interlocking. I have the heart one, the goat necklace, but it's with a big heart and a little heart and they link together. And it's so cute. I remember when I see my friend wearing it, I'm like, where'd you get that from? She's like, Gorgiana. So I was like, sent the link. I'm like, I like this. <laughs> <laughs> and I got it for Christmas, so that was really nice. And then I'm gonna go to the furniture store tomorrow, and then I also need to do some laundry, so I'm gonna probably do that tomorrow. I'm off for the next four days. I'm gonna end the night right here, and I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everyone. It is Friday, December 29th. We are a few days from the new year. I cannot believe it's gonna be 2024. This is insane. But right now I just got dressed. I'm about to go to my go to my house first to grab something and I'm gonna go pick up my mom and we are gonna go to American Furniture Warehouse to look for couches. So I want to um the the bar stools that I want to get are on Amazon. I've already found them. I got a set of four for like 190 bucks. They look really, really cute. Do I need four? I feel like I don't even need four. I feel like I need three. I have a Kimade. That was given to me yesterday. I'd apparently Kim K's coming out with energy drinks. But it's 10 calories, zero fat, four, gar four grams of carbs, no sugars, no protein. It has biotin, B6, and B12. It's gluten-free and it's vegan. 200 milligrams of caffeine. So I want to see what this hitting for. I really, well, I don't be on time all the time. But I try to be on time. Especially when I know I'm running late. Because I, I don't think that it's a good quality to have. Like, I just feel, I feel like, especially when someone's waiting on you, it comes across like careless or inconsiderate of someone else's time. Because I don't like my time to be played with. So, how can I, in turn, be like, don't waste my time and then be late? Make it make sense, Quisha, because it don't. Yeah, me too. It, I hope it fits well in my apartment. It's so fit. Y'all, just fire me. Just fire me. Just fire me because why did I not take my vlogging camera? No, seriously, I had got some bad news. Or not bad news, like bad news in my world. And I just threw my damn camera back in the I don't feel like vlogging. I'm too upset, but I had to take care of business. So I did end up getting the couch. I got me a couch and I got two end tables. This is the couch I bought. So that's the couch that I got right now. Thank you, mother. Let me make sure. Okay, mommy. Love you. Man. Put my tags on my core. Y'all. Girl, this is on my tag. This saying my car was towed. <laughs> I already know that. I got out the towing thing. The vehicle listed below has been towed. We know that. These are not my tags. Did I have my tags delivered to my house? I don't even know. Oh my gosh. Life is just doing me dirty right now. Just tell me you don't like me. Just tell me you don't like me because I don't understand. I don't understand. Hold up. Hold up. Mother. Those were not my tags. It was a notification saying, we've been notified your car has been towed. Right. So I don't know if you I had them. Ass mother. You trying to be like Shut me up. so bad. I, didn't, I don't know if I had them to, uh, my tag sent here or my apartment. But I checked my mailbox last night. I didn't see them. So if you, if you see it, let me know. You're trying to copy me so bad. That's crazy. Huh? You're trying to copy me okay, so bad. Okay, not you, boy. Okay, mommy. All right, thank you. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, so... I have to use the bathroom so bad. I have, to, I have to tinkle so bad. I don't like using public bathrooms. It's really not my. Um, I'm gonna keep my receipt in here. Yeah, but I'm about to go inside, and um, I'm gonna hang out, chill out, whatever. Yeah, I'm stressed. I'm stressed, and I'm not gonna talk about what I'm stressed about. Y'all see how I abruptly ended my last segment? That's why I was like, 
I'm, I ain't got time for this right now. I don't even want to vlog. That's one thing about like I being like a content creator or vlogging. Sometimes like you don't have to, but I don't like the feeling of like, oh, I need to vlog or I have to film when I'm like not in a good space or I get bad news or I'm feeling sad. Like you gotta push through. It's no different than like, if you have a bad day, you still gotta go to work, you still gotta clock in, you know what I'm saying? But one thing I won't force myself to do is like get on camera if I'm like not in the best headspace. I've did that before. I remember when I was going through my breakup, I was like trying to put myself back into the spirit of like filming, but I was like really trying to just push through. And I remember I had, I think I still have that video on my channel. It was like a three strand twist out using melanin hair care. Legit, after I turned the camera off, I balled out crying. <laughs> I was like going through it, but I said I gotta push through and I was just smiling and everything in my video like, hi guys. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm gonna turn that camera off, baby, but yeah. One thing about it, two things for sure, at least my makeup is pretty today. At least I'm sitting pretty. Anyways, you guys, I am going ahead inside and I will see y'all later. Hey y'all, so just an update. I'm about to be with the girls tonight, you feel me? We're about to go to Little Rituals. <laughs> Little Rituals. Little Rituals. I've never been there, but I hear it's a beautiful experience. So I'm about to head home right now and get showered and dressed and ready. Apparently, we're all wearing block. I don't have any liquor. <laughs> she said, you got any liquor at your house? Well, let me know. I ain't got no liquor, baby. I'm about to go home, shower. I'm about to beat my face down. I got this be like big old pimple right here. I don't know who she thought she was, but she need to get up out of here. Cause I wish I had a pair of boots that come up to my knee that were like flat. I don't have any flat boots. I was supposed to do that before winter came and I never found any. So all my boots have heels, but it's a lounge area. So we're gonna be sitting down and that's like my only gripe with wearing heels. Like if I got somewhere to sit, I'm good. But that's the vibe. I'm not gonna be vlogging with my camera because who's carrying this big thing around? Not me. I'm gonna vlog with my phone because actually if you watch my last vlog, I vlogged a little bit on my phone and it looked very fine. It looked real good with that cinematic babe. So I see you iPhone. Anyways, y'all, so I'm about to head home and get dressed. I'll see y'all in a bit. I got 20 minutes. Let's see what I can do. Okay, let's do this. Came out and you fell in the deep end. You done came into my life while I was a good referral. He be deep and talk crazy to me, but Kendrick know I like the regular girls. I'm not good with the regular girls. That's your girl. Maybe I don't have promo fat. I'll never tell them you made me, girl. Get them girls off the stage, cause somebody's gonna get taken. Somebody's gonna invade on a one on one. I mean, are you surprised? I, I'm not actually. With every passing moment, thoughts of you run through my head. 
She's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous girl. Gorgeous, gorgeous girl. It's a dead night, yeah? It is not dead. Look at this. It's, <laughs> quite, no it's quite quiet out here in the wild, yeah? Where? Look at this. This creature here. I no, this, the Maria was close with Alicia. I sweat it and I'm wearing natural, I'm wearing natural deodorant. So you know it's all bad. All I can think about is getting me a handy wipe and wiping my armpits. My feet hurt. Where, we gotta get to Stella. We gotta get to Stella. We gotta get to Stella. You bet not go barefoot. You bet not. Yes. Work. Work. I totally burnt off that chorizo burrito I had earlier today. You did not? I'm, I totally burned it off today, tonight. Oh, I had a chorizo burrito. You have a fucking sandwich. <laughs> Fire me. Fire me. Fire me. Fire me. I woke up this morning stressed. No. It's just because I'm preparing for my move, so I'm selling. Oh, good morning. That is such a rude way to introduce yourself after being gone for several days, Quisha. I came in, y'all, 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 y'all. I've just been living. I've been living my life. I've just been living my life. If they forget this dang camera, so sorry. I I feel like I work well under pressure, but sometimes I really question if I do because, babe, the way I get easily stressed out sometimes, you would think like. She don't work well under pressure. Cause sometimes I don't. So what I was saying was that I reneged. What time is it? I got to go. What am I talking about? That's not what I came up here to talk about. I came to talk about why I was reneg why I was re why I am reneging. I remember my big chop video. I said something along the lines of like, I'm not gonna put heat to my hair for the first two years. Fail. Like putting heat when I say putting heat to my hair, I just meant like flat ironing my entire head right but i did use i did flat iron my whole entire head like a few months ago when i had got a uh, sponsorship to use some clippings um and then i ended up like braiding a port a big major portion of my hair down and then like flat ironing the leave out part and then i was like it looked better yeah i washed blow dry and flat iron my entire head last night because i was so thirsty to figure out how long is my hair right now sorry y'all this is if y'all watched like my a vlog not too long ago where i like put my morning routine it was just quiet and i just it was just quiet i think it was like a montage and i put when i woke up in the morning i put slowing my thoughts down this is exactly what i'll be talking about but my thoughts are out loud because i'm vlogging right now so today i am going to wear the overalls that i never showed you guys when i went um thrifting that day I think it was my last vlog. Cause it's so cold at my job. I'm sick of it being cold all the time. All the time. God is good though. Pure. Let me go ahead and tinkle and brush my teeth because the um the fact that I got on this camera with no regard to y'all's feelings and y'all knows this. And I'm just all over here like, hey y'all, with my morning breath. Y'all like, girl, if you don't pop a tic tac, a listerine strip, and get out my face. I hear you, I feel you. Y'all, I caved and boss went on TikTok shop. I knew I shouldn't have been on there. Y'all, I went on TikTok and like someone was like advertising to TikTok shop and I bought it. But I didn't even spend that much money. I bought four plain long sleeve t-shirts in a ray color of socks. Like, it's like eight different socks but different colors. I bought two glasses, like not shades, but like they look like prescription glasses, but they not. 
a three pack of workout shorts, like the like the tights. Eighteen dollars for all of that. I was like, how can I pass this up? And it's supposed to be delivered between the second and the fifth. It's the fourth, and I stopped getting shipment updates after the 28th of December so but it's kind of funny because it's like right after Christmas right before New Year so I'm looking for my next update like hello yeah last update was the 28th I don't like this this is one thing I did not want to do or I was afraid of was like ordering something and then just never receiving my package yeah they all are at a transit center it says that was the 28th how do I follow up on this 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. oh it's UPS that's a that is not UPS tracking. That is a very long tracking number. Oh, see, okay, so it's not updating. It's not updating the TikTok shop, but or the yeah the TikTok app, but it is going to be delivered today. Yes, yes, I didn't get scammed. Let me turn my bacon for my permit. Lord, oh, it did work. Oh. Like I was saying, my order is on the way. My order is on the way. Girl. All right, you guys, so I'm running late for work. I have to go, but this is my outfit, nothing special. Literally a sweater, overalls, and the shoes. People wear leggings to my job, so I'm like, you know, I was just supposed to put on sweats, but whatever. Um, this is my hair, flat iron, and baby, it's frizzy. It's giving frizz. It's giving, she's going into a low, curly, wet ponytail this weekend because, babe, it's so stiff. It's stiff, and I don't like it, so that's, that's neither here nor there. Gotta go. Bye. Hello, everyone. So, this is gonna be one weird vlog because I keep... Uh-uh, TikTok, don't be texting my phone. It's gonna be a weird vlog because I keep popping in and out. It's, it's just been weeks. I actually took a break from vlogging last week and I said I was gonna start again this week, but it's just been busy, busy, busy. I believe it's the 6th of January. I took my braids out. I don't, I don't know the last time I seen you guys, but I took my braids out a couple days ago. I did show you guys, I showed you guys my, my, my hair was flat ironed. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna flat iron my hair again until like the end of the year, like when it cools down again. I think by then my hair will be like at a length and at a point where I'm like, you know what? I'm, I think I could go for a silk press, but right now, nah, I'm just gonna rock my hair natural or put in a protective style. So this week has just been busy, busy as far as like my real jobs. I work in the finance, the finance department of the my job, so I don't want to say banking. I think it's different for different organizations, but definitely at my job, we're wrapping up the fiscal year, so it's just we have we're trying to close on time, but it's just been mayhem. Where I actually worked overtime today, I've never worked a weekend at my full time job because it's just one overtime is never offered at my job and two it just we just don't work on weekends but i had I actually talked to my boss i'm like yo we're not i don't think we're gonna finish on time i don't think we're gonna close on time so i think ask like if it's possible for us to like work a couple of hours a night this week to finish some work blah, blah blah right now i'm getting dressed for a date night i think we're doing bowling we kind of were like trying to figure out we were gonna go to the movies because after i worked today um i ate and took a nap so i'm like oh well, i'm this is the perfect time to go to the movies because I've napped. Normally, um, if I decide to go to the movies, I have to take a nap during the day because I'm, I'm I'm just that girl that falls asleep any and everywhere. So yeah, y'all, I got my hair in a curly ponytail, like a slick pony. If y'all want a video on it, I was gonna film it, but I don't have time today. But let me know if you guys want a tutorial on how I do my slick pony. It's done in under 20 minutes, so getting dressed it's really cold today so i'm not gonna be like i'm more so dressing for comfort or, or warmth and not like trying to be extra cute technically i'm not late you know because did he reserve a lot are we going bowling did he reserve a lane he'll let me know when he gets here oh that's what i was going to tell you so it was a very stressful week at work i got off work i was going to all these different stores looking for this gel and i had it in my mind that when i get home i'm going to go on a run like if you guys i don't know if i told you guys i don't know if i was vlogging at that time like in 2020 during the shutdown that's when i started to find the joy of like going for runs and jogging and stuff i feel like it keeps going in and out of focus and honestly i was trying to lose weight really and i ended up really loving it so i was like this is cool but i haven't ran like that in a long time so i was just really stressed and i'm like i just need to there's like other factors that play into my stress right now 
I just have like a lot of different things going on right now and I'm just trying to remain steadfast and um, just not become too overstressed. Is that an eyelash? It is. So I went for a run last night and I was so excited or so happy with my with how I did because I haven't ran like that since like went on any kind of run since I last big chop which was like October November of last year so I stretched a little bit um did some mobility stretching get my joints warmed up and then I went for my run I ran the entire time I did not stop at all and I ran for two miles my first mile my average pace was like 10 minutes and 50 seconds and when I heard that in my, my I was running my airpods and it split one mile Average pace, 10 minutes, 50 seconds. I said, okay, let's pick up the pace, let's go. Cause once you like get the hang of it, at least for me, when I get the hang of it, when I'm like a mile in, maybe half a mile in, I can't, I, I won't stop. I'll just keep going. So once I heard that, I said, let's speed it up. And then my second mile was nine minutes and 40 seconds. So I was like, what? I ran the entire time. I did not stop before. I would be like a half mile in. I'm like, okay, let me stop a little bit. Let me slow down. But I just kept going and I was so proud of myself. I'm like, okay, great. I need to start doing this more often. So that's all. Right now I'm going to, let me tell him the door is open because I'm about to play my music and I'm trying to jam. Yes, I'm about to put on a little bit of music. I love James Morrison. I've been listening to him like every day. So much craziness surrounding me. You make it real for me. Like holy water watching over me. I'm running to you, baby. I hope you're not afraid of heights So how can I in turn be like, don't waste my time and then be late? Make it make sense, Quisha, cause it don't. But I know we have a reservation? No, we're just going in there. Okay, I'll be done in like 15. Oh, I thought I could have sworn like we've pulled up a couple of times. People would be like parked all kinds of ways, child. It's a cul-de-sac. What's up? What's poppin'? <laughs>
simple type I ain't stupid, dumb or blind Won't sleep, be a bit of a lies Heard you mad at 